Are you facing issues with your Google Nest camera not connecting to your Wi-Fi? Don't worry, this is an issue that affects most Nest users. I highly recommend that you watch this entire video as the exact solution to your problem might be one of the several fixes that I mentioned throughout this video. So let's get into it. The first and absolute best thing you can do for your Nest cameras right now is to reset the cameras and pair it once again to your Google Home app from scratch. Although there are less time-consuming methods, I do recommend that you first reset your cameras and proceed only if your issues persist. Now, resetting your wired Nest cameras is as simple as power cycling them. A power cycle is simply a hardware-level reboot for your Nest cameras, ensuring that all the internal components of your Nest camera get evenly charged for the most optimal performance. If you use a wired indoor camera like I have here, just unplug it from power and plug it back in after a minute. If you have the battery edition of the Nest camera, just charge it to 100% and let it stay at 100 for about 15 to 30 minutes. You need a pin to press the reset button on the body of your camera for about 10 seconds to initiate the reset process. To remove your Nest camera from your Google account, open the Google Home app on your phone and switch over to the home that you set your camera in. Then tap on Devices under the bottom toolbar to open the list of devices in your home and select your Nest camera. Tap on the three-dot menu on the top right corner and open settings. Then tap on remove device and confirm your decision. Just set up your camera once again by tapping on the add icon on the devices page. Although Google devices support the relatively newer 5GHz Wi-Fi bands, I do recommend that you connect your phone and set up your Nest camera with a 2.4GHz Wi-Fi signal as it offers better coverage and therefore less chance for signal drops. Okay. If resetting your Nest cameras didn't solve your issue, then you need to take a look at the status LEDs of your camera. Nest cameras have status LEDs built in and it's the light that pops up when you boot or use the camera. A green light indicates that the camera is working properly. If it's blinking yellow, your camera is trying to tell you that it's not receiving enough power from your power outlet. If the status LED does not show any light, there are a number of things that the camera is trying to communicate with you and here are the reasons that are more relevant to our case. Your camera is turned off or not receiving any power or your camera is offline. Now that we're fixated on two possible scenarios, let's deal with them one by one. Power delivery issues in our case can be quite deceptive as the device will also lose connectivity with your Wi-Fi if it does not receive enough power. So, first check if your Nest cameras are connected to your power source properly. If you have worn out cables, it's best to get in touch with Google support and replace them as soon as possible. While you're at it, this is the best place you can perform power cycles on your device like you did before. Just unplug the device from power and plug it back in. If you're still facing issues, you need to make sure that your Wi-Fi is set up properly. The first thing that I recommend is to just power cycle your router as it usually solves most Wi-Fi issues. Just unplug the router and plug it back in after a minute. If you have multiple routers in your home, you'll need to make sure that your cameras are connected to the same Wi-Fi that you set up the device with. Next is to check if your Wi-Fi has access to the internet so as to connect to the Google servers. The best way to check that is to first connect your phone to the same Wi-Fi and check if you can access the internet. You can try booting up this video on YouTube and clicking on that red subscribe button to ensure that your internet is solid. If you have an ad blocking system set up for your router, like a pie hole, See if disabling it solves the issue. If not, try adding this domain to your blacklist and check if your cameras are connecting to your Wi-Fi. In case you still can't connect your cameras to your Wi-Fi, try using a Wi-Fi connection from a different router. There have been cases before with Acer routers blocking security camera access, especially cameras with a two-way top feature like Nest cameras that in turn resulted in the cameras not connecting properly. If you have further queries regarding your Nest cameras not connecting to your Wi-Fi, feel free to comment down below and I'll make sure to help you out. If you found this video useful, do give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more Nest Camera content.